seen things, a few things before. The universe you wouldn't believe. Hey, welcome back to No Man's Sky. I am... Um... I am trying to get on with this game, and I'm trying to think about what I want to do. And I think what I want to do is just hang out up this planet for a little while, gather some resources, try and find the space station, and get some upgrades, and get some cool stuff. So this is going to be taking place on the same planet. Hopefully I won't be dead. I'm just, I just might fly to, I know there's a question mark and I know there's like a space station. Um, but first I have to figure out how to run. run R3 that would have been helpful okay there are a lot of things I like about this game and a lot of things I don't like about this game I have to be honest um, I really love um, the beauty of this world the aesthetic I have so much respect for the developers hello games who made this game I think they put their heart and soul into it and it shows they work so hard on this. Um, and I just think they did an amazing job. I mean, it is a brilliant piece of art. It, it literally is a brilliant piece of art. But I like, you know, like I like finding the things. I like um, damaged machinery. Okay. Oh, okay. New technology discovered. And they have, there's so many cool things that you can discover and see. And I like the little riddles and, you know, going to talk to the vendors or whoever they are, like on the little, on the little, you know, um, landing pads. Deflector shield. Oxide. So we need oxide. Okay. That is great. Okay. I do want to find the transmission signal. And I want to explore a little bit, too. And I like the exploration. I like, I love the environments. The music is just like what makes this game and puts it over the top. It really is beautiful. I don't know where. Oh, damn it, I gotta learn. I gotta learn not to like kill myself every time I jump. Oh, okay, iron oxide. I need that. Okay, let's R1 this. Because I need this for that object. But I have to say, it seems a little tedious. I have to be honest. Um, like the actual, just like um, like gathering stuff. Like I'm not, I'm just R wanting this, and I'm not even like looking, you know, what I'm doing because I know it's gonna take about 40 hits before I can get it. Um, the flying controls were a little wonky. Like I said, it's really sensitive. I'm not the best driver, so you know, please take that with a grain of salt when it comes to me flying and driving in video games so I mean honestly um, you know not you know don't take that too seriously but I feel like it's a little tedious I feel like um, like once you you know I like I fed the, the creatures and I thought that was awesome recharge mining beam with isotopes um, where's my mining beam Here it is. Okay. Um, but the actual um, playing, like I said, uh, I know you can get into combat. I know that, you know, there's other things that you can do in this game. I have to be honest, it's not my favorite game. I mean, this game has had so much hype. I, I feel like no matter what they did, they could not live up to the hype, you know, and I expected that, you know, I just expected, um, I expected this to be a little more, um, I know, like fun. <laughs> I really don't think it's a ton of fun. Like, uh, uh, to be honest with you, I had a lot, I had so much fun playing Headlander. I had so much fun and liked playing even Song of the Deep, you know, like it doesn't have to be this epic, 
um, you know, uh, video game for it to be like, you know, it still has to be fun to play. And I'm, you know, I, like I am doing this because I want to like level up and I want to, you know, I feel like it's the same motivation over and over again. Doesn't mean that I don't appreciate and respect the hell out of them for making this game the way they made it. I think it's brilliant. I think it's the most, one of the most imaginative and different games we've ever seen. And I have so much respect and, and love for the game developers who, who did this game and created this game because it was so, so, I mean, what a job to take on, you know, for them to do this. Um, but let's see, let's transfer. Um, you know, but it was beautiful. I mean, the game is gorgeous. Feeding the animals is like one of my favorite parts, and it's just, um... Oh, are you gonna yell at me because I'm taking this? Um, and I know it is exciting, you can, like, you know, you get into, like, firefights, you know, when you're flying in the galaxy, it is gorgeous, but... Um, like I said, I, I want to explore this planet a little bit more before I take off into the, you know, universe again and travel, but... What happened? Oh, I can't even... What happened? Um, they, and I'm not thrilled with the fact that they don't give you any kind of heads up, like scan, like you should be scanning everything you find, like, um, you know, like, um, when I found the animal. Oh God, here I go. I'm going to kill myself when I hit the ground again. Um, you know, so that's a little bit of a problem I have with it. It seems a lot of the same and a lot of, you know, land here, find this, upgrade this, mine that, you know, and I'm lucky because I've been on some, oh shit, replenish life support systems. Okay, good. Um, you know, so it just seems like a lot of the same and I've been watching other playthroughs. Um, and a lot of people love it, and I take nothing away from them. I think if you like this game, you are enjoying it. Oh, okay. Cool. Like, it's satisfying when that happens. Like, you feel like you're making some kind of progress. Oh, cool. Um, and it feels satisfying when you do stuff like that, but I feel like there's no, like, end goal in sight. Like, I, there's no story. Like, there's no kind of, there's no narrative. Um... You don't know who you are or, you know, how you got here and all that stuff like that, which is fine. Like, and I knew I was expecting that, but I think I just, I need a little bit more, um, from like a narrative standpoint, from like, uh, you know, some kind of story. Um, but that's me. Don't take anything else away from this game. This game is gorgeous. Oh, okay. Is this the beacon? Oh, I need a bypass chip. How do I get a bypass chip? Like they don't tell you anything like oh here's my little buddy um how to do things and how to get things you know um so that's the kind of problem i have with it like you know scanning things and how to like like seeing like now i'm running oh thank god for running um you know and it's just i want to explore a little bit more but i kind of feel like i don't know that's just me Crash arrive in 12 hours. Wow, where the hell did I go? Oh. Let's see. See, this is one of the things that I should have been doing is keeping track of where I kept my, 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 my ship. But it is beautiful to explore. There's so many amazing things to see in this universe. I mean, it's insane. Hi. Oh, look at the baby! Like this. I want to feed you. You look... Hungry. Oh, heridium. I need heridium. Oh, I want to feed you, baby. You're so cute. Zinc. I gotta feed the baby. He's hungry. Oh my god, he's so cute. What is heridium? I gotta see the... Oh, you're so cute. Like this, like the interaction with the animals is like one of my favorite things. Um, he's so cute. Incoming signal. 
let's run. Let's see if we can get there. Oh, is it up there? Um, but this game, so this, you know, this takes nothing away. I think that this, you know, Hello Games really, they should, oh, okay, there's something here. Um, did I come across this already? I think this, I was here. Yeah, this is what I saw already. All right, so we're close. Oh, what is, did I walk right by this? Yes, I did. Um, they work so hard on this game and it's gorgeous. And if you are into this type of game, this is, I mean, you cannot go wrong. This, it, I don't think it's 100% my type of game. I think for the sole reason is that it's lacking a narrative, a story, you know, um, and I am just like, my favorite games are like story-based, you know, heavy character-driven story-based games. You know, that's just me. But I think it's brilliant. I think it's gorgeous. Um, and I think it's beautiful. Um, but to be honest, I don't know how much more I will play at this. I, I have to say, it's... I'm just being honest, I'll never, you know, I'll never, um, oh, there's more. Oh, cool. Destroy a oh, okay. That is sweet. So we need om Omega Vortex Cube Carbon. Oh, okay. Now I'm going to look for that. Like, instead of, like, rushing off this planet like I did with the first one, because, you know, I just wanted to get off and, and fly, um... I gotta feed this. this. This is like bothering me that I can't feed that little baby. I gotta get food. I do wanna travel up here. I'm like afraid of. You know, this is pretty cool. Yeah, no. How do I. How do I fly up there? Like, not fold. Like, kill myself whenever I land. Um. Okay, let's see. I think that might be the thing that I need. Okay. Blue. That's what I might need to feed the baby. To feed the cute little baby. But I'll always be honest. Like, if I say, you know, I'll say, like, I really like a game or... What is this? Oh, okay, cool. Um, I'll, I'll be honest. Like, I... And, like, I have to be honest right now, it's it's a beautiful game, but it just... Oh, shit. Okay, um, but like I said, it's... It's just not, like, my type of game. Doesn't mean it's not a great game for anyone else who's, who are, who's into this. I just, when did it say arrive in, oh god, probably 100 hours. Um, it's not my favorite game in the world, but it is a beautiful game. And I, oh. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm trying to, like, pulse, pulse it so I don't, like, kill myself. Um. But... I think it's gorgeous, but it's definitely not my favorite game. I probably won't be playing too much more of this, but I do want to play enough of it where I get a good feel for it. You know, it doesn't mean it's a bad game. It's just not 100% for me. I mean, I just, um, that's just me. Have so much respect. Oh, that's it. I gotta, like, pulse it a little bit so you don't kill yourself. Ah, uh, no. Maybe not. Um. Is this water? Can I go on the water? I'm afraid I'm gonna die for real. Um, can I go in? Oh, no. Definitely not. Okay, do not go in that water. That is not safe. <laughs> oh, God. 
That's a life support. Okay. What is this? What is that little guy? Oh, you're so cute. How do I... I forget. A scanner. L3. No, don't run away. You're so cute. Um... R3 to dismantle. See, why can't I scan? He's like stuck. Analysis. There you go. He's so cute. Okay, okay, okay. Oh shit. Shield. Hazard protection. Alright. I think the best part of this game is, like I said, finding the animals and scanning. Oh, thank god I figured out how to run. Oh, you don't have to keep holding it down. What is this? 11 hours? Oh god. Did I go around in a great big circle? I think I did. Because there's something else smoking over there. I think I was there already. I think I was here already. Unless this is another one. Oh no, it's new. Cool, okay. Oh, that's lots of plutonium. Oh, sweet. See, like, it pays to search around the planet you're on before you take off. Okay. I have 20 chrysonite. Chrysonite. Let's see. What was this little green? This is something I haven't seen before. Oh no. Good, okay, what is this? Um, I don't wanna keep collecting so much. Okay. It pays to look around. 11 hours, like you could spend like literally all day on this thing, on this planet, but. But I do like looking around for things and I do like, like I wanna try and find this signal where it's coming from and. There's something new, oh what's that? Is that like an information thingy? Oh, thank God for R3. Oh, I gotta go around. What is this? Knowledge stone. Oh. See, this is satisfying to me when you find things like not just like keep getting the same stuff over and over. This is interesting to me. So I like that. I mean, so if you have this game, like, leave a comment. Let me know how you feel about it. Did you feel like, like, I feel like the hype was real. I don't feel like it was, you know, um, I don't feel like it was overdone. I think they delivered a beautiful, amazing, I mean, like, this is like things that you would only have dreamt of 20 years ago playing like video games, you know, it's unbelievable. It is just, it's miraculous what they've done with this game, and I give them all the credit in the world. Um, you know, to be completely honest though, like I said, it is, 
it's not the most fun game to play, but it's uh, like The Last of Us wasn't a fun game to play. But I loved it. You know what I'm saying? Like, it was just... I still, like, I just, like, yesterday, last night, I had nothing to do. Like, I was, like, done recording and everything. I played The Last of Us again, and I will play that game any chance I get. It is the most... And I, it's so stressful, but I love it so much. It, so it doesn't have to be, like, fun to be enjoyable. You know what I'm saying? But it's, it's just not the most fun game to me. I'm sure it is... I'm sure it is very fun for a lot of other people. And I hope that whoever is playing this game gets the most out of it that they possibly can. Because it is such an amazing... It is an amazing game. It's just, like I said, personally, it's not my favorite type of game. Doesn't mean it's bad. It's just... That's just my opinion. My, you know, everybody has their own opinion. That's just my opinion, and I'm just keeping it real really real <laughs> that's that's all I, I would never say something that I didn't think was you know true exhausted wait for stamina to recharge yeah that sounds about right I'm exhausted just all this running around I'm not even doing it um where can I go see now I can't even jetpack over there it's over the water. I need to get my plane. I'm so far away from my plane right now. <laughs> my plane, my ship, whatever the hell it is. Oh, hi. That's like a sentinel, I think. Keeping his, keeping his eye on me. I can't go near that water. Can I cut across or is this water? I can't tell. Yeah, I cannot go in that water. That will kill me dead. Okay. I didn't know if I was going to be able to climb up here. Okay. Um, look how beautiful. This game is just so gorgeous. Arrive in 11 hours. Damn. Um... I'm just looking around. I haven't even seen the the like other two items that that I need for the um, upgrades uh, to. Uh, whoa! Look at this. I need like I forget what it was called. I haven't even seen anything different that I need to that I need to find for this these things that uh, these upgrades that I've gotten. I have so much platinum. I just like clicking on the flowers. <laughs> They're so pretty. Okay, cool. Well, this just looks so pretty. It's gorgeous. Do I need plutonium? Oh, a new discovery. Okay, cool. Oh, cool. Let's fill up this inventory. Okay. What was that other thing that was like a new discovery? Okay, I already discovered this. Okay. Oh, okay, so at least you're hitting some sort of save points. Drifter, okay. See, I like this. Like, it feels satisfying at least when you are feel like you're accomplishing something, you know? What is this? All right, I am going to stop this here. Um, I hope you enjoyed this playthrough. I'll probably do one or two more um, videos of this. It is so gorgeous. It is so. Um, it is just. It is just an amazing game to play. It is like I said. It's 
beautiful it's fun and satisfying when you find things and you catalog things and you know things that you haven't seen or animals and you get to feed the animals that's my favorite part um but i'll probably go back to the ship and see like what else i can do like i want to go to the space station but after that i don't know how much more of this i will play um but i hope you guys who are playing it are enjoying it um that's just my opinion but i will be back with some more stuff and some other videos too um so i got some a few things coming up so thanks so much for watching guys i hope you enjoyed this video i'll be back with some more thanks